We are back in Las Vegas 2022 after three long years. Innovation continues to drive the future of our industry at an accelerated pace. Fast, furious, and constant, we have everything you could possibly imagine right here at NAV. I'm Ashley within Broadcast. Joining me is Simon of Bridge Technologies. It's great to see you after these Ashley. three long years. It's amazing to be here. Can I give you a hug? You can. Oh, Ashley. <laughs> This is what we've been waiting for for now years and years and years. We're so glad to be back. And you know, thank God we used the pause to actually do something interesting. So we are launching here at the ABC, uh, you know, NAB show, this marvelous ability for our 440 to also do signal generation. It's just a small kind of thing, but it's kind of useful. I mean, why would that be useful? What's, what's that needed for? Well, let's say from a production kind of standpoint, then basically you fire up your outside broadcast vehicle. You haven't fired up your cameras yet, but you have actually placeholders for any kind of resolution imagery. The four individual, uh, you know, uh, uh, generators can do then 4K, 2K, HD, even 720i, if you like, and then be individually controlled by NMOS. So it's cool, but it's just a small thing. But then again, we're so happy to be back here where we can actually do stuff. So when is the next time we're going to see each other? Well, I hope soon, I hope I hope very soon. Is it at IBC? I hope so, oh. we, we will see. So We're already planning for the future. Think about it, two years we haven't been planning for anything right. because we've been lost in kind of weird space. Right. I'm very happy that you're here. We are too. And so in that time though, what, what kind of trends have you noticed in the broadcasting and media market? And well, how have you kind of shifted with that? First of all, it's, it's something that we've been planning for a long time, but that accelerated during the last two years, and that is remote workflows. So basically it means that with centralization, you can then enable people to have a distributed workflow. If you have then, let's say you need five camera painters, they can be in five separate locations, if you like. If you want slow motion operators, they can be on several types of locations because again, everything is under IP control and with the low latency ability of having both multi-viewers and mosaics, well, you can do it from anywhere. That's the mega trend that's going to dominate the industry going forward because everybody is going to need it. You know, it doesn't need to be a pandemic. It can be just for redundancy. So it's very exciting. It's almost as exciting as your booth behind me. We have shuffleboard, lots of fun things. I absolutely love it. We have to have fun because really, it's so great to be back. Holy Moses, yes. What's your website where people can see more of your uh, information? Go to www.bridgetech.tv. See the latest and greatest. Yes, bridgetech.tv. Everyone check them out. Thank you so much, Simon. Always be a pleasure. Or be square. That's right.